All right, guys, here are the unnecessarily long credits. I am not kidding. And you know what I'm going to do during this? I'm going to speed it up. Oh, yeah. You know, Sonic Team or whatever, <laughs> whoever made these credits, my God. Look at this. They are displaying the beginning parts of this one name and one part at a time. They could have fit so much more into this. Look at this. But at least they let you actually grab some whisk while you're here. You can actually, like, you can pretty much fuck about with these names, like destroy them, all that other good stuff. Some of them you could fall through, others you could stand on them. <laughs> A pretty damn interactive uh, credits. It pretty much distracts you from the fact that it's really unnecessarily long. My god, man. And, of course, they also have the wi other wisp powers, such as the laser. And let's just... Da -da 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 -da. Also, they let you collect rings and such, but honestly, they have no purpose now. You just beat the game. <coughs> and if you've been following this Let's Play, yeah, all the red rings. There we go. <coughs> My god. It's as if the T-1000 sneezed all over the motherboard. And, goddamn, I don't know why I referenced that. I don't know if you guys actually seen that one video with, like, the Nintoaster. Like, this one dude making, like, an instructional video for the Nintoaster. Because, like, my buddy Titch showed me that, and that video is hilarious. I might post a link to it if I ever find it again, because, honestly, I can't remember where, what link it was. And here we get the drill right here. Destroying names like nobody's freaking business. I mean, look at The way they're showing them right now, they're showing it, like, two or three names at a time. Oh my god. Alright. These credits go on for quite a while. And, like, you know how, like, Sonic Colors was, like, located or released in different regions, and the Rocket Power Wisp in this area, in this whole thing, <laughs> is, like, really pointless to use. Because, watch, you'll see right now how it works. Because <laughs> you still move like that. And you just hit the roof, and that's pretty much all you do. <laughs> but anyway, you guys know how, like, Sonic Colors was released in different regions. How, like, in the European release, it was released as Sonic Colors with a, with a U in it. But, yeah. Guess what, guess what they had the balls to do in these credits? They actually credited every single Sega, pretty much every area that Sega's, like, based in. Like, Sega of America... Sega of Europe, Sega Spain, and I'm just like, okay, what does this have to do with the American version? I am not kidding. I, it will come up eventually right now, and you're going to be like, holy crap, they actually did do it. <coughs> anyway, I'm just using the of power right here. I still cannot believe they did that. Couldn't they have just shown off, like, the different regions for each of the different regional games? Like... If they release the Sonic Colors, if they release Sonic Colors in Spain, they just show the Sega Spain credits. <coughs> if they release this in America, just show the Sega of America credits. And maybe Sega Japan, since, you know, S Sonic originated from there. But nowhere else, I think they also put Sega Australia. My god, man. <coughs> But also, I've actually got myself some medicine for my cough. Granted, it, I just took it today and I haven't really felt its effects, but at least I don't feel like I have to cough every, like, every 10 seconds. Because trust me, that was getting annoying. Anyway, right now I'm recording this on, like, November 23rd, and this, like, on my last day of finals, and it's, like, the same day I uploaded Part 48 of Paper Mario. I must say, though, I felt like I did pretty good on my last final. Then again, I didn't really feel, really feel well during my last final because, like, for some reason lately, like, if I don't take any, like, uh, nasal decongestion medicine, then my head starts, my forehead starts hurting like crazy. And I forgot to do that today. And so I had to take my last final. Like, I had to take my last final with a huge forehead pain. And my god, painful. Anyway, you guys are probably hearing, if you guys are hearing it behind my freaking, uh... 
If you guys are hearing it behind my commentary, they're actually playing music during this uh, credits. And now they're playing Reach for the Stars. You know what? Out of respect, I'm going to play this part normally. Pointless Wisp! You know, I just barely realized. I finally get why they made the credits so unnecessarily long. Oh yeah, and here they have like the all the wisp at once, and I'm like holy crap. And I just got the frenzy one. I finally get why they made the credits so unnecessarily long, and why they made it so destructible. I mean, look at this. <laughs> they made it so long and destructible because they knew the credits were long, and so they want you to vent your frustrations of it being so long on the credits so yeah it's like holy crap these credits are taking so long i'm going to take out my frustrations ironically on the credits if that even makes any sense i'm pretty hopefully you guys understood what i meant by that anyway here it is sega of america here's where they start crediting all the sega like in all different regions of the world and now they're on Sega of America. I'm pretty sure everything up until now was just like credits of the game itself, and now they're just crediting everyone that's helped in every area. Hey, Brandon. Oh my god. This is the painful part of this game. Sitting through the credits. I don't even think I could skip through this. And you know what they had the balls to do, too? Like, if you start up your file after beating it, then, uh... <laughs> If you start your file up after beating it, they have this one little hidden area where you can look at the credits again. But at least there they had the decency to give you a skip option. Kind of redundant at that point because you wouldn't want to run the watch the credits again. So yeah, thankfully they added a skip option. Because imagine if you ran into that by accident, you're just like, oh, what's this? And then all of a sudden you're watching the credits again and you can't skip it. Oh my god, the rage that would ensue! And I'm just destroying everything with the Q power. <laughs> Damn. To think, like, a little, a little over uh, two months ago, I started this Let's Play on my birthday. And not exactly the best Let's Play for a birthday, but whatever. <laughs> I mean, yes, this is a good game. I'm not saying it's not. But... <laughs> Honestly, I could have been more enthusiastic about this. Oh, look! Sega Europe! Uh, <laughs> man, this is gonna be pain. Oh, hey, Spike. And I missed the Spike. <coughs> and you would think because like they were playing Reach for the Stars right now, like pretty much the theme of Sonic Colors, like that would be over, but no, they're just playing more music. Now with this music, I don't give a mo I don't really mind. I'm just gonna let Sonic hang back like that. As, uh, yeah, I'm kind of tired of destroying the credits. And he's just stretching right there. He's like, yeah, yeah. So anyway, I hope you guys have enjoyed this let's play. As tedious as these credits are, it does not show how bad this game is, which it really isn't that bad in my opinion. Seriously, why the hell is there a point of the Rocket Wisp in the credits if it just moves you back and you just, like, hit the roof anyway? And there we go. 
I don't even know what to talk about anymore because these credits are still going to be going on for quite a while. There's still all the other Sega regions to check out, or the Sega regional credits. Oh my god. Uh, this is going to be painful. And here we go. <coughs> More bacon! Seriously, there's no point to collecting these rings! What the fuck, man? And look at all these. Oh look, Sega Germany! What the hell does Germany have to do with the American release of this game? <coughs> oh my god! Oh, those were short. Now it's Sega Spain! <coughs> oh my god. They just had to put something. Sega Benelux! What? What the hell is Benelux? Where is Benelux? <coughs> what? And Sega France. Uh, what the fuck is France? <coughs> what is this France you speak of? I haven't the slightest clue. And look, yes, Sega Australia. Yes. <coughs> so there's Spain, there's Europe, there's Germany, Australia, and Benelux? No, Benelux, that just babbles me. What? Where is Benelux? Oh, yeah, I'm just gonna call this title Where in the World is Benelux? And the Physics by NVIDIA. I'm assuming that's the physics engine or something like that. I don't even know. <laughs> and now they're crediting the music. Reach for the Stars opening thing. Vocals by Jean Paul Marklov of something something. Music arranged by Tomoya Otami. Something along those lines. Electric guitar, soon something, something. I destroyed their name. Screw them. They are irrelevant now. And. Yeah! I have no need to know any of this. At all! And speak with your heart. If you're wondering what speaking with your heart is. Oh, it's gonna be coming up right now. Trust me. And. Eh. <laughs> Honestly, these like vocal songs that they use for Sonic Colors are a little too poppy in my opinion now. I mean like the music itself is in the game is poppy, but still, it didn't have lyrics. And that you would kind of respect it for in my opinion. But this, but when it has lyrics with it, I'm just like, uh, speak with your heart. When you know that is a lyric, you're just like, uh And chief producers, Tono, to show to sub some something along those lines. I'm just destroying credits. I don't even know what I'm doing anymore. <coughs> oh my god. Also, I think I've thought of what to actually do about uh Actually, I think that already that one uh, "Speak with Your Heart" already played. I think it was the first song that played during these credits. And they are done. Yes. And they give us lives. Well, that's very useful. Silence of space right about now. Sushi, hey, I heard they started using fish. Bob, we didn't bring any with us. Not that we can eat it since we're robots, but we kind of looked at it. I love looking at stuff. I love stuff. The fire show game was great. Hey, how did we get all this stuff to blow up like that? Anyway, loved it. By the way, the are All right. 